Hi, I'm Liz Fuller from the Southport Historical Society. And I wanna tell you about a new project that we're doing to support the, the society and also Brunswick Community College. So we're doing a collaborative quilt in the community. So members of the community are all uh, creating quilt blocks and then we're gonna put them together and create uh, two big quilts. So the, um, the quilt is called the Color Me Southport Quilt and it's based on illustrations from this uh, coloring book by Pat Carney, local um, artist. She's done this book and now she's just recently published part two. So if you have part one, you probably wanna get part two. And she's done these wonderful illustrations of iconic Southport landmarks. And so we're coloring those and we're putting them on fabric and then putting them into quilts. So here is a sample quilt pro uh, project. Uh, one of the squares. You can see this one is Provisions um, Company and she's done it in a with circles and then big bubbles because it's like underwater because it's the fishing thing. I really like that. And here is a lovely one. Um, I think this is the Crimes of the Heart House. Oh, you can't really see it. Let me see if I get back further. Crimes of the Heart House and um, she's really displayed that. Uh, very uh, prominently because it's such a, a great illustration. So these are just some examples. You can do whatever you want with, with it and be as creative as you want. So I'm getting ready to go out actually and deliver some of these quilt kits to people who have purchased them in the community. And so it says, color me, and everything's backwards, color me Southport quilt project. And you pick one of these quilt kits and you don't know what's inside until you get it. So I'm going to open it right now with you and you can see what I got. So I picked this one because it was a purple tag and I really like purple. So this tag has to be returned with the, with the project because it says who quilted it and who sponsored it. And if somebody else colored it, we can put that on too. And then all of those names are gonna go on the back of the quilt. So I'm opening this now. I'm gonna save this tag, very important for when I finish. Uh, we'll see what's in here. So I've got some of this um, coordinating fabric, all the quilts, Squares will have this fabric. It looks like paint splattered. It fits with the theme of Color Me Southport. And then a contrasting fabric. Mine's black. They, there's other colors if, uh, if you want to pick based on that. Some are purple and orange, different colors. And then I've got um, a piece of batting so I can quilt it with some backing fabric. So that's, that's um, all the materials that I have. And then there's instructions in here on how to do it. Oh, there's a piece of um, fabric. This is that paperback fabric that you can uh, transfer the coloring picture. So once I color my picture, I can transfer it to this and then I can and then peel off the back and then I've got fabric and I can make that part of my quilt. All right, now for the big reveal, I'll see what I um, what illustration I got because there, there's a prize you don't know till you get it. What is it? What is it? What is it? Mine is, oh, the Crimes of the Heart House. Oh, you can see it's a lovely illustration. And that's the one that was uh, in the sample. We are making two quilts. So um, we're gonna put all of the pictures on both quilts. So I'll have to do something different with mine than what she did in the sample, get kind of creative. Looks like I've got a lot of coloring to do. So what I'll do is I'll check back in with you guys after I have my picture colored and um, you can see um, how that's going. So. Um, please let us know if you would like to participate in this. The quilt kits themselves are for a $10 donation. Um, and then we have several months to, um, to color them and to quilt them and then get them back in. And then we'll turn it into um, two great big quilts that we're going to raffle off uh, in Winterfest 2022. So uh, comment below or uh, send an email to info at southporthistoricalsociety.org. Uh, thank you.